right when I'm in the middle of this adoption, Lizzie gets a call about a dog that's in really bad shape. Oh my god, what the is going on today? Where am I going, Elise? Um, take a right. A former employee just called Elise and I in a panic and told us that there was a small dog on the side of the road who seemed like she was dying. I'm actually just worried that she might not be alive by the time that we get there. There, right here, right here. Dead? To see a guy just standing over her and crying. Hang on, okay, hang on, hang on. I actually thought she was already gone. Did it die? No. Oh. Uh, it's not oh my it's god. Getting eaten away. Did you see it get hit? No. Uh, he called me when I was turning the corner. He was sitting here, like, trying to. Right here? Right here. Trying to pull his way to over there, but he couldn't. Okay, he baby. Back. So when I saw her on the side of the street. I was riding home. I had a break from work. And uh, I turned the corner, and I saw a dog dying in the streets. It really broke me into pieces. With the claws are being eaten away by maggots. Oh, my God. Underneath his crotch is just all maggots. OK, Papa. OK, down. buddy. OK. Oh, my God, oh, my God. When I see a dog that's dying, I'm not really thinking about anything else other than how can I get this dog to the vet as quickly as possible. I just opened my car door. I just tried to move as quickly as possible, but without moving her too quickly, because I don't know what her injuries are. OK, baby, OK. I can't diagnose her right here, so the only thing that I can do is get her to the vet. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Come on, come on, come on. 